Listen to that crowd. This is Michael Cole with Taz at Ringside, bringing you SmackDown action from Seattle, Washington. They're already going crazy, and the action hasn't even started yet. You know tonight's show, Cole, is going to be off the hook. No question. The SmackDown superstars never fail to bring the house down, and Seattle will never be the same after tonight. What a deadly submission hold this is. We might see a tap out right here. You won't surprise me one bit. The longer you stay in this, the more risk you have for serious injury. Wow, look at that submission. I ain't never seen it executed better. Neither have I, partner, and this might be enough to get the tap out right here. That reversal might stop his opponent's momentum dead. And there's the reversal. This is rever I don't think the fans like that one too much. <laughs> I'm sure this breaks this guy's heart. It should. These fans are the lifeblood of WWE, and he doesn't give a damn what they think. Watching these superstars go at it reminds me why I prefer to stay on this side of the announce table. Oh, come on, Paul. You know, you should let me train you. You could be Cruiserweight Champion in like a year. Oh, no. I've heard stories about the way you train people. You make Marine drill instructors look like pushovers. Duh. They're just training people to go to war. I train them to be WWE superstars. Well, thanks, but no thanks, partner. I think I'll stick to announcing for now. I think that if one of these superstars successfully executes their finishing move, this one is over. That ain't necessarily the case, Cole. Just because it's called a finisher doesn't mean it always ends the match. You sound like you're speaking from experience here, Taz. Of course not. Oh my, the submission hold is locked in. And this ain't easy to get out of either, Cole. I've been locked in this hole before, and it hurts even worse than it looks. I can't even imagine the amount of pain that this hole must inflict on a star who winds up in it. There's not a superstar in a locker room that can afford to ignore these fans, Cole. You're right about that. Without the fans, we'd all be out of a job. Submission hole locked in. We may see a tap out right here. And even if you can't make your opponent tap out, this will take a lot of fight out of him. Benoit's a great technical wrestler, no doubt about it, I'm telling you. But after taking all the abuse he's taken in his career, I don't know if he's got what it takes to win here tonight. The smart money never bets against Chris Benoit. Has. He's got a well known reputation for coming out ahead in just about any encounter. He saw that one coming. Tell you, Cole. He smells blood in the water, Cole. He's going straight for the submission. And this could prove to be a decisive moment in this match. You know, Cole, I got a lot of respect for Chris Benoit, but he also jumped back and forth between Raw and SmackDown more than any other superstar. It almost looks to me like he might be choosing the path of least resistance, if you know what I'm saying. Oh, I doubt that very much, Taz. Chris Benoit never runs from anything. He's no coward. Whoa, 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 whoa. listen, I'm not calling Benoit coward. I'm just saying that he might have a knack for picking his spots. He's got a surgically repaired neck, don't we forget. Who could blame him for wanting to take it easy? Well, from what I've seen of Chris Benoit lately, he does everything but take it easy. All right, Cole, you know what? I'm just going to drop it. It's pretty obvious. We've seen this before. He'll do whatever it takes to win and take every advantage he can. Hey, you know, that's not going to make it popular, but you got to do whatever it takes to win. It's so great seeing these athletes compete here tonight. I had a feeling they were going to wind up against each other sooner or later. There were times when it seemed like it wasn't going to happen, but I can't tell you how glad I am that it did. That's for sure. You know, any time you throw these kind of combustible elements into a match, you're guaranteed to get a hell of a show. And that's exactly what we're seeing here tonight. Each of these competitors is looking for the slightest hint of weakness in the other. 
That's the law of the jungle, Cole. This is dumb. Why is he risking everything by going up there? These superstars have been going hard all match. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE Three. superstars comes into play. No doubt, Cole. There ain't no way you're going to win a match Four. if you're out of gas two minutes into it. You can say that again. I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast their opponent. Six. Oh, man, these fans are fired up now. They sure are. And you know that's going to have an effect on this match. You just don't see action like this every day. You sure don't, Taz. And we've got the best seats in the house. No doubt, front and center. We couldn't be any closer to this match without being in it. <laughs> Whoa, that's your territory, partner, not mine. I'm perfectly happy staying right where I am. I think Benoit might have lost a step or two when he took that little vacation from SmackDown, you know what I'm saying? We all know that the competition on Raw isn't exactly impressive, and I think Benoit might have gotten a little rusty. But what are you talking about? If anything, Benoit's be... This guy might not have enough to kick out. Man, this match is so good. He has the submission hold. I've seen a lot of superstars tap out to this one, Cole. You and me both, partner. Here's your 